We both have much bigger problems right now. I'm guessing she's meant to be there, I'm but sorry. she's invisible. I just want you to know. Okay, I'm going to pretend we're talking to this guy's butt. I've got your back, all right? All right, hey guys, Nukes Plays here with episode three of my Batman Telltale series playthrough. So this is going to carry on from where we left off on the other two episodes. So let's jump straight in. This is episode three, New Old Order. Here we go, guys. So we're going to get a little recap, but I'll give you my own one as well afterwards or beforehand. We'll see what happens, see how much time I've got during this loading screen. Basically, everyone got shot to fuck. Carmine Francoli got shot in the fucking head. And then Mayor Hill got shot in the fucking head. There's these people called the Children of Arkham who has a masked guy at the head of them. So we don't know if that's a new guy or whether he's like a, another villain that's kind of undercover as this other guy. Um, but yeah, that's basically what's happening. And Batman is having the Wayne family name dragged through the mud. And uh, yeah, that's pretty much it. So here we go. Bob and Regina Zellerbach. Of course I know these two. Regina here is the chairwoman of Wayne Enterprises. You can't trust anyone in Gotham. Least of all those you call friend. Your parents learned that the They're waiting for you in hell! Then it just felt light. Like I could do whatever I wanted. No guilt. No consequence. Cobblepot wants retribution because we took his family's land. Your father, Falcone, and I, we had ways of getting anything we wanted. How do you think your family got the land for Wayne Tower? But what would Harvey think? The two of us working together. Let's get out of here. Keep on doing what you're doing, and the rest of Gotham will start to see you like I do. A hero. So, sorry, ladies and gents. As you might have guessed, there's been a change to tonight's program. We need a new moderator. You there! Yeah! Yes. Yes. Right. Thank you for volunteering. My downtrodden brothers and sisters of Gotham, you have nothing to fear. We are the children of Arkham. <laughs> Mr. Dent. <laughs> Thank you. <laughs> So yeah, that part where we uh, picked up Harvey was we could choose whether to save Harvey or save Catwoman. And I chose Harvey because Harvey is just a dude and Catwoman is like a freaking cat burgling, ass beating badass when she wants to be. And so I was like, she'll handle herself. And she, she did. I mean, she got shot, but still she handled herself. Uh, so yeah, I wonder if that's going to have any consequences as we continue. <laughs> Gotham is still reeling after last week's mayoral debate. With the drugging and subsequent murder of Mayor Hamilton Hill, Harvey Dent was left running unopposed. After a rather lackluster election, Bruce, finally, a friendly face. Have you noticed how many times they've made him say face throughout this playthrough? It's like insane. It's good to see you. Oh, congratulations, Mayor Dent. How does it feel? Oh, it would feel better if I were out of This is very uh, romantic. Ready to get back into it. Giving him flowers. Oh, what have you got there? I, uh... <laughs> I brought you some flowers. Though I see I'm not the first. Yeah, well, my mother and my secretary. Ugh, every sick boy's dream. <laughs> One woman I thought would visit, or at least call, hasn't. Selena's been a no-show. I thought she'd at least come by to congratulate me, if nothing else. Guess we weren't as close as I thought. Maybe she just saw me being a coward. Yeah, she's probably just busy, hasn't had a chance to come by yet. You'll hear from her. <laughs> Easy for you to be optimistic about women. Pretty sure no one ever loses Bruce Wayne's number. I am glad you're here, though. God, it's been infuriating. Just 
sitting here and having nothing but time to think about what happened. I wish I could make myself turn it off completely. Watching footage of the debate over and over. Ping would have just beaten me to death right there in front of everyone. He wanted to. I mean, if Batman hadn't been there, I would be... I was helpless, Bruce. Helpless. I couldn't do anything. Batman was the one who stepped up. I mean, he's the reason I'm sitting here. That's enough from you. Hey, thanks. What they did to the Hill, to the moderator... I have to live with that. But you heard them up there. The penguin and that maniac on screen. Oh, this isn't over. I need to stay ahead of them. They're trying to cause discord. That stun at the debate was just the first step. They're after me. They're not gonna rest until all the names are crossed off their list. I can't just stand aside and let that happen. The tonight's speech, they'll know where I stand. Of course, the doctors aren't thrilled about me leaving. My therapist is worried the drug might have caused some issues to resurface. Uh, oh, anger issues. That'd be cool if it kind of like starts coming up as him having like an ang like angry, you know, slow. like I mean, that's impossible, right? Twists out of nowhere. That'd be cool. I'm not gonna be able to take it easy. How am I supposed to do that? We all have demons, Harvey. Yeah. Isn't that the truth? Honestly, I'm fine. Besides, I know I'm not the only one dealing with the fallout from that debate. I know how much you loved your father, Bruce. I know that debate was hard on you, too. Harvey, don't. You should talk about it. Finding out your dad drugged Esther Cobblepot. Hill admitting to having both of them killed. It's a lot to process. I'm sorry. Just because I keep reliving it doesn't mean you want to. This just proves that I never really knew him. He was just hiding who he really was. I'm sorry. I know you'll pull through this. <sighs> Look, I, uh... I realize what a terrible friend I've been to you. I was so focused on the campaign. I, I thought distancing myself from you was the only option. I'm sorry. You don't have to explain yourself to me, Harvey. It was the right call for the campaign. I get that. Still, I abandoned you when you needed me. That's not the kind of friend I want to be. We've been fucking nice to him. What is that? Batman symbol. Coming from near the GCPD? <laughs> That's one way to get the guy's attention. Well, it's lucky they were in a building where they could see it. And look, I, I should get going, Harv. What? Already? What else do you have to do? <laughs> My assistant won't be here for another hour. You can... You can stay if you want. I, uh... <laughs> I have a date, actually. What? Why didn't you say so? Well, don't keep a lady waiting on my account. I do want to hear all about her later, though, all right? You pervert. You keep your head up, Harvey. Thanks, Bruce. Okay, so it said Harvey will remember that, so I wonder if later on we're gonna kind of fuck up and say something, and he's gonna be like, what, I thought you had a date. They like making the bat symbol out of uh, different things for these franchise logos, like the, the Dark Knight, how it's got, I think it's the fire in the building uh, makes the logo, on at least on my front cover. I think it's one. It's like one of them, what's it called? It's got like a special word. It's like where you look at it, like a holographic kind of thing, where you look at it from one side, it's like the, the flames flicker or some shit, I don't know. It looks cool, I like it. Unit 6 in pursuit of suspects westbound on 15th Street. Is it the children of Arkham? Can you confirm? Negative. They're taking shots at us whenever we get close. Understood. Stay on them. We'll think of something. A little help would be nice. Hang in there, alright? Oh, they knew we'd be there, Jim. We don't have enough officers to deal with this. Look, everyone stretched thin. I'm doing what I can. He stretched his wife thin last night. I have to go. That light has a bat on it, Jim. You give me a number to call, I'll rethink my methods. I'm just glad I got your attention. I didn't have a lot of options. So, here we are. Not a bad idea. I'm impressed. I have good ones every now and then. 
I'd rather have you arrested than come to you for help. But the truth is, we're desperate. I'm calling a truce. Just for tonight. Bring me up to speed. Right. Rene Montoya, one of my officers. The one who tried to shoot me? I know, but hear me out. She's trying to clear her name after those animals manipulated her into killing Falcone. She's supposed to be on leave, but she got a tip on the children of Arkham's chemical stash. Went rogue. She's out there alone, and I can't spare anyone to back her up. I told her to wait, but this is personal. The children of Arkham pumped her full of that junk. I'll find her. We'll take down the children of Arkham together. That's what I like to hear. These children of Arkham are everywhere all of a sudden. Where the hell they all come from? I, mean, I never heard of them before. Then that debate... You want answers? Ask Oswald Cobblepot. Cobblepot? I'll bring him in for questioning. Gordon, this is Schultz. Over. Gordon here. We got a problem with the mayor, sir. What happened? Is he okay? I don't know. We lost him. He took off and left us behind. Christ, one more crisis I can't deal with right now. One job. Fucking hell. Gotta keep both Montoya and Dent safe. Somehow. I'm on it. You there? Always. Launch the drones. I need eyes on the city. Lucius has made some upgrades. I'll let him explain. Who are you talking to? You got a whole team or something? A friend who can help us. That friend got a name? Bob. All right, patching you through to R&D in Wayne Enterprises. Batman, so listen. The first model was only equipped for visual surveillance. Oh good, I didn't think but we'd actually see him. I thought they just kind of like reference him. I thought you'd need an audio feed as well. The microphones are incredibly sensitive. They can pick up sounds from up to 500 yards. In some cases, you'll even be able to hear through walls. Like x-ray peering. And why didn't I already have this? Tech upgrades take time. Yeah, motherfucker. I do run your actual research and development department as well. That was a good comeback. Any idea where they might be? Montoya's car was spotted crossing the bridge to Arkham Island. Hmm, she's going to the asylum. Could be where the handoff is happening. What about Dent? I'm probably headed to his acceptance speech. I just left the hospital and we lost sight of him. We're gonna have to pick between the two. Okay, well, let's listen to both first. Barrels of this stuff to transfer. And not a big window to unload all of that. They said they wanted it done tonight, so it's gotta be done. You wanna argue with them? Be my guest. You just keep an eye out for that cop. Nobody move! This is the police! Get her! She's fucking dead. Uh, okay, and then listen to this one. What do you keep looking at? That car's been behind us since the hospital. Oh, God, is this guy trying to drive us off the road? Just drive faster. Oh, what the? Oh, damn it! Uh, okay, Rene might already be dead. We've, we've been looking after Harvey a lot, so I'm going to say let's go to see Montoya. Headed to the construction site. Send whatever men you can spare after Dent. Because we know they're going to keep Dent alive until the thing happens, so... I'll round up what officers I can. Gonna have to head out there myself, too. I know this is risky, Batman. Just be careful. Because them killing off Rene would be very... a very them thing to do. Unit 6, requesting backup. Corner of 15th and Main. We got a major disturbance here. Several armed suspects on the loose. That's a cool on-off switch. I want one of them for like my light bulbs, just like a big crank. <laughs> but yeah, I wonder what the consequences of us not going after Harvey will be. That might be interesting to see what happens there. Are these different masks again, or are these ones? Oh, here we go. 
God damn. Come on, me fam. Oh shit, that's gnarly, man. There's no way he'd be able to throw it that well. Is he like fucking ninja? What happened? Or did she shoot him? Oh, bang. Oh, shit. That's like one of the Arkham City over. ones. Drop the gun. Look, that's like a cool reference I if that's what I'm that was going to shoot you, okay? Oh, what? I used to think you were a threat, but I was wrong. We both have much bigger problems right now. I'm guessing she's going to be there, I'm but sorry. she's invisible. Can you forgive me? Those guys had me pinned down. If you hadn't shown up when you did, I... You want forgiveness? Look somewhere else. I just want you to know... Okay, I'm going to pretend we're talking to this guy's butt. I've got your back, alright? I don't know what I was thinking, coming out here alone. I nearly blew this it. This game is... I, I could I, I've said it last time, I love the game. On me. You're lucky I was here to clean up the mess you made. This was reckless. You're one to talk. I don't need a but lecture. But the fucking technical shit is letting it down a whole hell of a lot. Coming. I mean, you're right. I could just quit and then come back in, but this is funny. So fuck it. Dead. And she's got really weird, like, character design. She's like, she's like a melty like face. It's kind of annoying. Someone's got to help Gordon. They know he's coming. Go. I'll see what I can find here. I'm not giving up on this. Okay then, so that that was a nice conversation with uh, Rene Montoya's ghost right there. So, yeah, basically we literally just turned up, beat the shit out of some guys, and then just left it there. So that was random. Plus, I wonder if this guy that's following Harvey is even anything to do with the children of Arkham, or whether he's just like someone else. Like maybe that they're going to introduce someone else in now. They knew I was coming. They seem to be getting info on the GCPD's whereabouts. Not sure how. I need an update on Harvey. Bringing it up now. Deborah, get down! <gasps> Mr. Dent, what did you do to him? I said get back in the car! There's more of them coming! Put down your weapon! There's too many of them! Put them in take cover! You'd better get down there! On my way. After playing, like, Life is Strange, we get, like, such extended sequences. It's kind of weird going back to a Telltale game where it's kind of, like, smaller, like, set pieces, like, like boom, 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 boom. It moves much more quickly, which is good in some cases and bad in some cases. But I'd say... I'd say mainly good because you're not, like... If, if, there's, not, if there's, like, a boring section like there was in the last episode of uh, Life is Strange 2, but there was like a really boring section in that. So it does avoid it by being like, okay, now we're over here, now we're over here. I do like that about it. it keeps it fresh and like interesting. Like, okay, what's gonna happen now? Where are we gonna go? Self-defense, he says. New mayor's pretty tough, turns out. Killed one of those guys attacking him with his bare hands. Dent did that. Guess the fellow's lucky Dent got to him before you did, huh? You have something to say, then say it. We all know how you operate. You've been trying this nice guy routine lately, but I don't buy it for a second. At least this one died quick. What are you trying to say, motherfucker? And our asses handed to us. They knew you were coming. How? We've been using a secure channel. You saying we got a leak? Mmm, it's my favorite vegetable. Gordon, Gordon to, to command. command. Anyone, Anyone there? there? Command here. What is it, Gordon? Hmm, so they're tuned into the police frequency. Turn that off. What? what? It's been compromised. The children of Arkham are listening in on the GCPD's communications. You silly bastard. Come in. You're 
I'm gonna look into this. I'll let you know what I find. Like, I do like the idea of the kind of predator touchscreen gauntlet thing, but it looks like a fucking mess. Like, whenever you see it, it's just like a bunch of weird shapes jammed onto his forearm. It looks so weird. And again, another quick, like, st stop, start. Here we go. Look, we're over here now. Okay, now we're not. We're going over somewhere else. So what, what are we doing now? Are we tracking, trying to track down where they are using that chip that you took out of that thing or what? GCPD's been compromised. The children of Arkham were listening the whole time. How? That's what I'm going to find out. Alfred, I'm sending over evidence of some kind of encrypted communication signal. It's coming up on my screen now, but I'm afraid it looks like a bunch of gibberish a bunch to me. bunch of gibberish to me. I need to go to Wayne Tower and look into this. Get me Lucius on the line. Yes, right away. If the public finds out the police aren't able to communicate... <sighs> We'll fix this, Alfred. We'll make it right. We just have to stay focused. I admire your determination, sir. I've always just been a be fan of your steady Bruce. determination. I have Lucius on the line now. Bruce, are you there? I'm looking at this data Alfred sent me. It's messy. It looks like gibberish. I have to know what the children of Arkham are doing. How fast can you decrypt? It's a tough one, but I should have it cracked soon if you can meet me at Wayne Tower. Already on my way. I do like the sky, the sky looks really awesome. Might be kind of like a, not a reference to, but kind of drawn from the animated series uh, with like the kind of darker, like kind of maroon, burgundy, like skylines. Cause apparently they, um, apparently normal cartoons, they draw on like white sheets or whatever. And that was like the first one where they started off, their, their background was black. And they like went over the top of it. That's like one of the things I learned. I think it was like a mini documentary thing that I saw about it. Uh, but I thought that was pretty cool. All right, you know what, guys? That'll do it for the opening part of this episode. So I want to thank you for watching. And hopefully you'll join me next time where we see what's going to happen at Wayne Tower. So thanks for watching. Stay awesome. And I'll see you next time for part two of episode three of Batman Telltale series. Thanks a lot, guys. See you next time.